Normally, the job of the reporter is to tell you the story of an event. But in the situation of last Wednesday, the story truly tells itself. The Innocence Institute of Point Park University has been involved in 14 cases where convictions have been reversed over the last eight years. Obviously, it says a lot for the kids. Uh, they're very dedicated and very bright, and they don't take no for an answer. They have been well trained and well taught. They know how to dig and investigate. You know, really the focus is on not what they've done for tonight, but what they do every single day and how hard they work every single day working on these cases, not knowing which one's going to really turn into something and turn into, uh, to, you know, ultimately an exoneration. I, I don't have words for it. I usually have words for everything. Uh, I'm just deeply appreciative because... Uh, We've been working so hard at this inst instance institute for 10 years, and I know what my students do, and I'm just happy that everybody else is getting a chance to see it. The night was not all fun, though. There was also the story to create awareness of one Pittsburgher situation before and after exoneration. Drew Whitley is a guy who we uh, exonerated after 19 years in prison, and uh, the system hasn't treated him very well. And his lawsuit this week was, or last week, was uh, dismissed, which I find to be uh, one of the worst things I've ever seen in the innocence process. Uh, but we're going to keep fighting, right? It was Bill. And Bill said, um, Mr. Whitley, I know you don't know me, but I know you probably heard of me. I said, yes, I have. And he said, um, we just get, went over your case. After all these years, we went over your case. We finally got to your case. And he said, it's a shame. He said, we can't believe it. He said, I'm going to do everything in my power to get you out of there. And thank God for Bill Mitchell. <laughs> Pennsylvania is one of 20 states with no compensation for people like Drew. Okay. So the majority of the states have a compensation scheme. A lot of them are brand new, and they vary from uh, so much a year for, to one lump sum, whatever. They're all over the map. A case Drew filed in federal court was dismissed last week because the police, according to a judge, did not commit a crime during the course of a shoddy investigation. He served 19 years for a crime he didn't commit, put there by the state of Pennsylvania, by the prosecutors, the police, the juries, the judges, and kept there, okay, for 19 years. He was innocent. He was exonerated. It's been proven, okay. He will not receive a dime. So this guy who did 19 years in prison got nothing, period. We don't have a compensation statute in Pennsylvania. 30 other states do. It's an outrage. For Point News, I'm Josh Rakedic.